Okay, so today I'm cooking with Sai Ua. This is a sausage that is from Chiang Mai in the northern part of Thailand. And it's got a lot of flavor in it. It's got lemongrass, it's got some uh, uh, chili, it's got rice and pork in it. So it's very interesting sausage to work with. What I've done with this is I've chopped it up into little pieces and I'm just frying it off in a pan. We're gonna do some noodles tonight for dinner. It's a very, very simple recipe. Um, if you're ever going to Thailand, you should come back with this. So I've got my Sai Hua chopped up and fried up a little bit. I'm gonna throw some simple vegetables, just some carrot, uh, sorry, some carrot and some beans. I'm gonna to toss it all up here. I've got some soy sauce, some fish sauce, wonderfully stinky but delicious fish sauce and a little bit of sesame oil. So the whole thing is gonna to come together. It's a very simple dish I'm making. But this is smelling so good. Okay, I've just chucked my carrots in here. I really should have gotten this on video, but what I did was I put some soy sauce and I put, put some uh, uh, fish sauce in here. So the whole thing is smelling very nice. I'm just gonna wait for these carrots to soften a little bit. And I'm gonna throw in my snake beans. So snake beans, what I've done is I've just cut them lengthwise. So if you look at this is what I've done. So I exposed the center and uh, I just like to cook beans like this when I'm doing Asian food. So then go to beans. You can do any vegetable really. Um, if you have some bok choy, throw that in. You just want something green. So get that in there. And this is really very simple. I don't want to overcomplicate this thing because the sausage itself has a lot of flavor in it. So I want to keep it simple. And I want to let those flavors really shine. Alright, so my noodles are cooked. I just boiled these uh, guys for a few minutes. Just follow the instructions on the packet ready. And I'm going to toss them into this in just a minute. So they're drying up nicely. I also got a little bit of uh, bird's eye chili, which is called chili party. So red chili party is going to go in there. I just think it needs a little more heat. And... Alright, so I've tossed the hell out of this thing. As you can see, everything is nicely mixed up. And I've just adjusted a little bit of seasoning, but that's pretty much it, guys. This is done. This thing is ready to eat. And so simple and so delicious. Come here. Okay, I can try one of those fancy things, but okay, there you go. 